In this nugget, we'll be looking at cells and batteries. These are chemical cells. Chemical cells store energy. They can be used to generate electricity within a circuit. Chemical reactions inside a cell create a potential difference that produces an electrical current. This is referred to as electricity. Cells, such as the one in the image, can be incorrectly called a battery. There are different types of cells, such as alkaline cells and lithium ion cells. The cell can be connected in series with other cells to create a battery. A battery is two or more cells connected in series. This cell can be represented using a simple chemical cell. Let's have a look how. This is a simple chemical cell and it can be made in a school laboratory. It's made by connecting two different metal electrodes with a wire. The metal electrodes need to be placed in contact with an electrolyte. Batteries are made using cells. Batteries consist of two or more cells connected together in series. You can see that these cells are connected in series because the conducting components of a cell form a continuous loop. Batteries are useful because the potential difference of a battery is larger than the potential difference of individual cells. Potential difference can sometimes be shortened to PD. The potential difference across a battery can be found by adding together the potential difference provided by each individual cell. So that means the potential difference provided by the battery is equal to the sum of the potential difference provided by each cell. Let's apply this to an example. The potential difference provided by each cell is shown. Determine the potential difference provided by the battery. The potential difference across each cell is 1.1 volts. So the potential difference provided by the battery is calculated by adding these up. 1.1 plus 1.1 plus 1.1 is equal to 3.3 volts. So the potential difference provided by the battery is 3.3 volts. OK, to summarise. Chemical reactions in a chemical cell produce a potential difference. A simple chemical cell is made by connecting two different metal electrodes and placing them in contact with an electrolyte. Two cells or more can be connected in series to create a battery. The potential difference provided by a battery is larger than the potential difference provided by each individual cell. Keywords Battery Two or more cells connected in series. Cell converts chemical potential energy to electrical potential energy, allowing current to flow. Electrode A conductor used to establish electrical contact with a circuit. In electrolysis, this is usually made of an inert substance. Electrolyte A substance which, when molten or in solution, will conduct an electric current.